Hello there and welcome to Intrigue Work, where we talk about goal-getter content and mainly focus on making money online. Today we're going to be talking about making money from ebooks. so let's get into it. Before we do get into it, actually, please do subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified when we do post up videos. We're currently doing a 30-day challenge where we're trying to make $1,000 in one month with zero dollars. So let's get right into this video. And actually, before we get into the video, if you want to find out more about this challenge, please do um, click that link below and it will take you to the video about the challenge that we're currently doing to make $1,000 out of $0 online in one month. For those beginners that have never made a single dime online, this might be helpful. Let's go. So are you looking to self-publish and make money? Um, it can earn you some serious cash and it means you can officially call yourself a published author. This is the dream, okay? Most people think that unless you get lucky and end up becoming the next J.K. Rowling, writing books is not an easy way to make money. But remember that blockbuster film, The Martian, starring Matt Damon, it actually started life as a humble self-published ebook. The book's author, Andy Weir, sold the novel as an Amazon Kindle book for 99 cents a copy. Before long, it was topping best-selling charts and Hollywood took notice. Give or take a bit of Hollywood glam, that's all publishing an ebook is. Take a text document, converting it into an ebook, and selling it. And we'll talk you through how to make as much profit as you can. Okay, so producing an ebook can be ridiculously cheap and often completely free. And selling your own ebook can net you anything from several pounds a day to almost nothing. The good news is that you get loads of say in your potential earnings. So it is worth taking a look at the sums. Ebooks sell from anywhere between 99 cents and 8.99 and up. Um, but the store will take a chunk, chunk of each sale, obviously. You can sell your book or whatever, for whatever price you like, and you can alter the price to test different tactics. But the ideal price depends on your book's length, reviews, and competition. If you've got cash to invest or can crowdfund to pay for it, you can spend money on extra marketing for your book to increase its chances of success. But there are lots of ways to market it for free, like on social media. So number one is choosing a popular topic. This is really important. We recommend writing about something you're genuinely interested in rather than just choosing a topic that you think is going to make money. If you have a book idea and you feel it would be something you'd buy yourself, if you saw it in a shop, you're in to a win, on to a winner. Your readers will, will also be able to tell if you're passionate about the subject and getting the words down on paper will be a lot easier for you as well. Okay, so there are two ways of doing this. You can literally just decide to, to take on a passion project and... Um, create content that you really, really, really love creating content about for the ebook, or you can actually go down the niche marketing route whereby you look at trending topics at the moment and you create an ebook surrounding that trending topic. For example, I made about fifteen thousand dollars by creating content surrounding air fryer recipes because at that time air fryers were really really popular and they still are and people were looking for content surrounding that particular topic and so i made ebooks i made free ebooks um pertaining to that so i made one on um air fryer recipes um meat recipes air fryer vegetable recipes and air fryer recipes for kids and i made a decent amount of money making those um ebooks so the, one of the ways you could actually do this is you can look at a niche, find a really popular niche that you think would um, sell, and then you can create a, a very small uh, website. It doesn't have to be something too extensive. You can create a quick blog, make sure you get about 15 to 20 posts on there, and then um, create an ebook around that. I would also strongly suggest that you create a YouTube channel as well that pertains to that particular topic. Um, that particular niche and create as many YouTube videos as you can. They can be faceless YouTube videos, it doesn't matter. And just really promote and boost that channel and use that channel and the blog to sell the ebook. That's a strategy that I've used several times and I keep using it and rinsing and repeating that strategy and it actually does work. So you can try that out. If you're really interested in finding out more information about how you can actually do that particular strategy um, with the popular niches then i will make a separate video about that in the future if you're interested in that and also if you want to delve deeper into this topic anyway you can click the link below and there will be more information in there pertaining to this particular topic okay 
So, best idea is to write as an ebook your original novel, poems, or short stories, your old essays, check of your uni first, or a study guide for your subject, a practical guide about something you know really well, living on a budget, bike maintenance, making the perfect dating app, profile, anything. A children's book, even better if you can illustrate it too, or graphic comics. City guides or a collection of your favourite walking routes. Out of copyright books, repackaged with notes, an intro or translation, sold under your own imprint. Okay. Another thing you can actually do with this um, is to create a book that summarises a book that's really popular. I did that for a book called Atomic Habits, you've probably heard about it, um, and another book called Dare to Lead, and those books were really popular at the time, so I created some quick um, summaries um, pertaining to those books, and I put them on Amazon, and they actually did sell. And how I sold those was I actually created book reviews on a blog, and then, um, like, book, re book reviews for popular books. And then I said, if you want to find out more information about this particular book and without having to read the entire book, then please do um, buy this summary. And the summaries, I was literally selling them for 99 cents, and they were selling pretty quickly. You can, you can even also make a YouTube channel um, reviewing books as well, and then say, if you're interested in finding out more information about this particular book, um, packaged in a very concise book of notes then you can do that another thing you can also do is um st study notes so for a particular topic that you're really interested in for example philosophy you can create um some very concise study notes that are written in the language of students as opposed to just written by some old man that doesn't really know how to talk to students Okay, so number two is make sure you write the book to a very high standard. The more time and effort you put into your ebook, the better it will be, and therefore the more you can ch charge for it. To create a high quality ebook, you will need to be willing to spend months or even years writing it and then proofreading and editing multiple drafts until it's up to scratch. Using free software to edit your ebook can hugely help it to improve its quality. We suggest downloading Grammarly to make sure your writing is free from spelling and grammar errors and try to get feedback on your writing from as many other people as you can along the way. If you don't have Grammarly, I will leave a link below for Grammarly so that you can actually um, sign up to that. The writing process might take a while, but it will be worth it to produce a high quality text. Not only will this mean you can add a higher selling price to your ebook, but your readers will also be more likely to recommend it to people they know, meaning more sales for you. And more sales is obviously more money. Okay. Um, so the next thing is to choose the best value publishing platform for you. Um, once your ebook's ready for publication, the hard work is nearly over. The next step is to take next step to take is when considering how best to monetize your ebook is to research which publishing platform you could make the most money on. For an in so um, Amazon Kindle Direct is obviously the most popular one most people do use. You've got Smashwords and you also have Apple iBooks author as well. Um, so you don't always have to go for Amazon. Another option here is if you already have a large following on Instagram or YouTube or Facebook, you can use that platform and um, directly link to a page on your blog or website that um, people can purchase the book using PayPal or any other payment method. Okay, so next up is to develop a strong marketing strategy for your ebook. Just as so it pays off to spend time writing your ebook to as high a standard as you can, it's also worth putting a fair amount of energy into marketing your ebook. To make money from your work, it's super important to get the word out there, and your ebook marketing needn't cost you a penny. Obviously, social media is massive for this, a hugely powerful marketing tool, so it's worth setting up professional accounts across major platforms like Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram that will be focused on promoting your, pu your published ebook. Okay. I would strongly suggest if you are writing ebooks um, that are with your name on them, for example, because sometimes people write ebooks in, we, we, you know, we're using an alias name um, because they don't want people to know that they've written books about cars or something like that. If you're writing a book about yourself, no, not about yourself, but um, with your own actual name, um, then I would strongly suggest that if you have an idea to write an ebook, then I would start creating content on YouTube. I would make a channel um, a, 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 about yourself. You can vlog, create um, blogs about your day-to-day -day life, your routine, um, your, your routine as a writer or as a, you know, whatever job you do. Um, 
and just build up your following on YouTube and on Instagram. And I would even strongly suggest TikTok as well. Build up your build up your influence, build up your authority, build up yourself as a brand in itself, and then um, you can use that. You can leverage your audience and actually sell your ebook to them. Um, so, for example, for, for inspiration, have a look at how your favourite authors present themselves online. Often, with successful writer accounts, you will see a good balance between posts about day to day life as, as a writer, like I just said. Um, about the, you know, if you're going to set up a YouTube um, channel with promotional posts about their books interspersed throughout. On top of this, it's also worth making a website with your writing portfolio that links out to where you where you can buy your book. Um, the thing about vlogging is that it can people get to know you, people get to actually really like you as a person. So a lot of the time, people buy because they like like yeah because they like your personality as opposed to. Um, the fact that they just want to read the book they might not even be interested in the book they'll just buy it because they like you so I would strongly suggest that strategy go hard on Instagram, YouTube, TikTok go hard, build up your social following really really go hard like posting daily, 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 daily daily. just just take an example from Gary V someone like Gary V he's really built up his social following so when, people, when, he, when, he, when he releases a book people just eat it up literally they just eat it up because they're just crazy about the man himself and the value that he provides okay next up enter your book into a few writing competitions after spending so long perfecting your ebook you deserve a little credit for your masterpiece writing competitions are not only amazing for kudos but they often come up with rather nice cash prizes too writing competitions aren't the easiest way to make money from your ebook as they're generally very competitive but they are definitely worth a go we'd recommend any writer to enter them a quick google search will help you find loads of writing competitions throughout the year Bear in mind that some will only accept unpublished entries, but sometimes you'll find competitions that are open to entries from published writers as well, to keep, so keep a lookout on that. Um, and if you win any competitions, you could list them on your social media buyers and website to build your reputation as a writer and attract more potential readers. Okay, next up is to publish a series of ebooks. If you publish a successful ebook and find yourself with a growing audience, you could consider writing a whole series of texts built around the same characters or themes. The best way to approach writing an ebook series would depend on the nature of your work, i.e., fiction or non fiction, but stick to your instincts about what feels right. Think about whether it would be a natural progression for your ebook to become a part of a series of, of works. For example, if your first ebook was a novel about someone's first year of university, readers would like to be taken, be keen to read follow-up stories about the students' adventures in their second and third years too. Make sure that if you do write a follow-up text, it's written to do to an equally high quality as the first. And above all, make sure any future books within the series all have their own artistic value and aren't written just for the money. You could make a fair amount of more money by writing follow-on ebooks, but only if your readers consider them to be worth their time and cash. Otherwise, you could be looking at complaints, refunds and poor reviews and no author wants that. Okay, so next up, money isn't the only perk that comes with writing a book. Here are some of the other key benefits of self-publishing an ebook: Quick publication. Rather than waiting to find um, someone to um, actually publish it for you, pitching to publishing companies and agents, you can get it done fast. It's a career boost. Getting a book to a market is great work experience. It's a brilliant way to boost your CV. Passive income, even if you don't become a millionaire, publishing a book can set you up with a passive pocket for many years to come. Anyone can do it. Don't be put off if you're not creative or super knowledgeable in niche areas. All you need is an idea, a bit of lateral thinking, plenty of motivation, time and and more information as to how you can actually build an income using ebooks. Um, so if you're interested in that, as in getting more information about that, then please do click the link below because there will be a bit more information in the description box um, as to how you can really, really further this and actually really make something out of it. All right. Bye bye.